Ever since the movie Jaws, people from all over the world have undoubtedly had an increased sensitivity, fear, and fascination for sharks. Of course, the fear is not completely unfounded. The U.S. has suffered around 2,000 shark attacks since the year 1900, and South Africa has suffered 554. South Africa's East and West Capes have been the targets of the most recent attacks, while the Americas, North and South Carolinas have been particularly newsworthy as of late. Both South Africa and the United States suffer these attacks, but the countries differ substantially in their response. The classic American response is one of intense fear and fascination, emotions that are due in part to media heightening, Jaws, and the Shark Week phenomenon. Meanwhile, the typical South African sensitivity toward sharks is actually one of understanding and acceptance. That is, South Africans tend to see the situation more pragmatically. Yes, it's horrible that humans get attacked, but it's an understandable risk when your culture is so deeply ingrained in aquatic recreational activities. The number of shark attacks is greater in the U.S., but that doesn't explain the full picture. After all, South Africa remains the only place on Earth where great whites breach ocean waters up to 10 feet, a terrifying sight to witness. While efforts to educate the public on sharks has helped repopulate numbers to a degree, June's uptick in attacks across the world may cause the latest hurdle in the animal's preservation. For more fascinating comparisons between South Africa and the United States, visit steencampsa.com.